Hello everyone. Today's lesson is about ideas of IELTS writing task 2. For both academic and general students. With the help of these ideas, you will learn how to write a high-scoring IELTS task 2 essay. Let's get started. Ideas for IELTS topics. Work on essay. The main question is, how do you get an IELTS score of 7 or higher? To get a high score, you need to use good topic language. Words and phrases that are related to the question topic. You need good ideas, in order to answer the question well. The next question is, how should you prepare for IELTS writing task 2? I suggest spending more time preparing than testing. When you test yourself, you find out what your level is. But you do not learn anything new. You will not improve, if you only write test essays. Before writing an essay, study the topic and prepare your ideas, opinions, and vocabulary. The topic that I'm going to discuss with you today writing task 2 for IELTS is related to education. Many students have no ideas or opinions about IELTS writing topics. Even if your grammar is perfect, you will not get a high IELTS score. If you do not know what to write, this video lecture is for students who want to go into the writing exam feeling confident that they have excellent ideas, opinions, and vocabulary for education-related topics. What are the benefits of education? First, education gives people knowledge and skills. Second, people with a qualification are more likely to find work. Third, they can earn a higher salary. The next benefit is, they can contribute positively to society. Schools aim to teach young people moral values such as tolerance and sharing. Schools prepare children to be members of society. What are the benefits of studying abroad? Benefits of studying abroad are. Foreign institutions may offer better courses. Many students want to attend a prestigious university. The best universities employ teachers who are experts in their fields. Qualifications gained abroad can open the door to better job opportunities. Living abroad can broaden a student's horizons. Overseas students are exposed to different cultures and customs. They become more independent. They are responsible for cooking, cleaning and paying bills. They will learn a foreign language. The next question is, what are the drawbacks of studying abroad? If studying abroad has some benefits, it has also some drawbacks. Like, living and studying abroad can be difficult. Students have problems with paperwork such as visa applications. The language barrier can be a problem. Students have to find accommodation and pay bills. Studying in a foreign language is challenging. Living alone in an unfamiliar culture can cause homesickness. Many students have no ideas or opinions about IELTS writing topics, even if your grammar is perfect. The advantages of technology in education are. Technology is a powerful tool to engage students. Technology can make lessons much more interesting. Students can do research using online resources. Students can study at their own place.
Adults can take distance learning courses. Students can study whenever and wherever they want. Students also learn skills that are useful for their future jobs. For example, they learn to write reports using a word processor. What are the disadvantages of technology in education? People rely too much on computers. Young learners do not become proficient in some basic skills. They use word processors and spelling may suffer. People should be able to write a letter by hand. Technology is no substitute for a real teacher. An experienced teacher knows what materials to choose from. Computers are expensive to maintain and can be unreliable. Technology in education. Opinion. Institutions should supplement traditional teaching with the use of technology. Technology is part of everyday life. It can enhance a teacher's lessons. Students can use online resources to help with homework. Students must still learn to write by hand. They should still use traditional sources of information such as books. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you will find benefits from this lecture. If you like it, please share, comment, like and don't forget to subscribe to my channel.